Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Jenny and this is Creating Crafts with Jenny. And currently I upload about three times a week. Sometimes on a Thursday I'll send something out there to y'all. Uh, but currently uh, this is a Wednesday and I got an awesome picture of what we're going to be working on today. I will put it right about here and we will get started on this project. Yes we will. I have a bunch of paint down here but I didn't, I used all these colors but I mixed some. Uh, the palette, which I will put a picture of the palette right about here, and I'll leave it up for a little while so y'all can see it. Um, it calls for a lavender, which I use Dollar Tree lavender. It called for a gray, which I have a slate gray, and it calls for a grayish green. So I did mix these two colors together, and I came up with this color here. To me, it's more of a green than a gray, but we'll see how it turns out. It also wanted a lavender and then it wanted a really dark green so I wanted a little bit of sparkle in here so I've got the Fang which actually comes from Dollar Tree but this is actually Amazon's uh, Mega Bottles um, so I've got that mixed over here also and all of the paints today are mixed with Floetrol and I'm just letting them sit here for a few minutes while I worked on my cameras and that sort of thing so I hope everybody's doing great um, I have been working like a crazy person trying to get these camera angles just the way I like them because I'd like to be able to talk to you and you guys also see what I'm doing down here below so anyway that's how that's how it goes anyway um I am going to flood my canvas with white and I have that mixed up over here and the white is master's touch which when I first started my channel that was my absolute go-to absolute favorite and the name of this palette is called Luxurious Lilac. We'll see. <laughs> okay. All right. So I, like I said, I am going to flood the canvas. I'm going to turn it this way because I'm wanting to do like a vein, and I think I'm going to go up, and we'll see what we do here. So I'm going to flood it with white, and so it has something to run around on here. Ooh, look at those combs coming out. I'm using Floetrol. Stir those in there. Ah, should have stirred longer. There we go. Okay, now it's all mixing together. All right, so I'm just going to give some paint right here in the center, and this just kind of gives the other paint something to work with. Um, so yeah, we have some paint, and all right, so. I am going to just kind of go through my colors. I always take my stir sticks out. It's just so much easier to pour the paints. Um, so, let's see if I can. There we go. And I'll be using the blood dryer on this. Let's do. Oh, these colors are so pretty though. You know, like I said, with these cups, you can squeeze them. A lot of people that do this type of painting um, use bottles, and you can use bottles too. Bottles work just as good. The cool thing about you can do so much with bottles. This is that, those two greens and the blacks mixed together. I 
I mean, it did go really dark, really dark gray. There's some greens in here, believe it or not. Okay. All right. Let me hit it with the blood dryer and see if we can get this to move around like we want it to. All right. bad. Um, no, it's kind of dry up here. I think when I was scraping off the white, I scraped too much off. Um, there's a lot of gray in it and, uh, you know, gray is like one of those really popular colors right now. Um, so I think that, I think it needs a little bit of glitter. <laughs> And I see a clump. Let me see if I can get the clump out there. I see a clump right there. Okay. All right. Let me throw some glitter on it. Make it rid of the gloves. All right. What kind of glitter do we want? Um. Yeah, purple. How about purple? Okay. Um. Let's see. These are like little salt shakers are kind of cool. Although I like it when I just put it on a spoon or something and just kind of blow it. And the glitter goes everywhere. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to leave it as it is. And we are going to let it dry and see how it turns out. <laughs> I think it's going to be kind of cool. Oh, it's had some heat to it. It's got some really cool webbing and that sort of thing going on. Um, I think it's going to dry pretty cool. I think I'll be pleased with it. Okay. Alright, so I will put some really cool pictures right about here, and then I'll put the Barbie furniture in, as I always do. So what do I always tell you guys? Go out there, be awesome, be great, do your thing, and I will see you in my next video. Talk to you soon. Bye.